lately, Apple has become a lot more open with its software in iOS 8. One of the biggest surprises we got at the last keynote was a new inclusion of third-party keyboards in iOS. In this video, we'll be taking a look at how these keyboards function in iOS 8. Thanks to TouchPal, I've been given early access to one of the very first third-party iOS keyboards. You can check out the TouchPal website by clicking the link in the description down below. So, after downloading the TouchPal third-party keyboard, we can head over to the settings and enable the keyboard for use. Then, going to a chosen typing application, you can select the third-party keyboard from the new option menu and begin typing. Overall, it's a pretty quick process for switching between various third-party keyboards and in some ways, it's easier than Android. As you can see here, I'm using the third-party TouchPal keyboard in iOS 8. This usage of third-party keyboards in iOS 8 just demonstrates the increasing openness of Apple. iOS 8 has really been a huge step for Apple, and I'm sure iOS 8.1 will also bring some pretty cool features to Apple's mobile operating system. Which third-party keyboard do you want to see in iOS 8? Post a comment down below with your thoughts. And don't forget to leave a like as well as subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching.